Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Golgothan and I am back with Minecraft Pixelmon, the mod for Minecraft that allows you to play it like Pokemon. Alright, well last time you may remember we found this Pokemon Center, we got our Squirtle and leveled him up to level 6. And we got our basic crafting and stuff situated. And today we are going to cr build an anvil and try to get us some Pokeballs and go catch us another Pokemon. My goal by the end of this episode is to have at least one more Pokemon in our lineup. Alright, well off camera I did some mining for some iron because I figured that'd be boring for you guys to watch. And I also found out that the anvil in the Pixelmon mod requires way less iron than the anvil in regular Minecraft. The Minecraft anvil requires that you make uh, it requires three blocks of iron, which require six pieces of iron, six iron ingots each, or something like that. Let me see. Boom, 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 boom. Nope. Nine. Nine. So each block of iron required nine, requires nine blocks, or nine ingots. Um, and then you would need three of those, so that's 29, or 27 iron. And then four more iron ingots. So 31 pieces of iron in normal Minecraft, vanilla, to make an anvil. In Minecraft Pixel, or in the Pixelmon mod, it requires merely eight pieces. Boom. So we can get this guy, set him in the corner here. And then we need a hammer. So we'll do that and that. And oh, let me grab some. Ah, forgot that you can't leave stuff in the crafting table. Pull some ingots out. All right, let's make a hammer. Bam, 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 bam. Hammer. And then, do we make these here? Oops. Iron disc. Take oh god! I keep forgetting to take my stuff out of the crafting table. So let's take the iron discs. Uh, this yes, there we go. And here oh nope, that's not it. That's not the button. So let's put discs and just smack it. Just smack it. Go, 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 and come on. Is it done? Is that it? Did I do it? Ah, iron base. There we go. All right. So let's do that quick here with these five. Oh, I gotta do it with the hammer. Oh, another thing. Um, I'm sure you noticed in the last video, at least I did while I was editing it, that uh, I was way quieter than I thought I was, and the game sounds were way louder than I had planned. So everything should be turned down a little more appropriate for this episode. Please let me know in the comments if it's still off. Also, I turned my fan off. I feel like that was making some noise. I'm not sure. Also, we need a name for our Squirtle and probably a name for whatever Pokemon we catch today. Um, and that can also be put in the comments and whatever the most popular name is or my favorite name, whichever I choose, um, will become Squirtle's new name. Alright, so we got five iron bases. Now we need. Button. What? Button? Uh, I'm not sure if it matters what kind of button it is. Let me double check. Stone button. Of course, I don't have any stone. Alright, well, I gotta go get apricorns anyway. To make Pokeballs, you need apricorns. You need three apricorns of the same color to be able to make the the start of the top part. So let's go find some red apricorn trees. I will probably speed this part of the video up, maybe slow it down a little bit when I get to the to the trees. But for now, I'll just speed this part up. Alright, and uh, I haven't gotten any of this stuff yet, but I did come across one of these blocks. 
And if I remember, I can mine them with my a with my pickaxe, and they give me leaf stone shards. And I don't know how many of these it takes, but I know it's what you use to make, obviously, leaf stones and evolve grass type Pokemon. So keep that in mind for the future. All right, back to f back to fast forward. All right, well, stopping again for one moment, I jumped down into this water, and when I came down here, this little thing looks like it's glowing. So I'm going to try to mine it and see what happens. Come on, big bucks, no whammies. Yes, that's what I thought. I believe that is a water stone shard. So that will do the same as the leaf stone, except for, obviously, water Pokemon. Excellent. Fast forward. Ah, here we go. This is what I'm looking for. Yes. Right here. The red apricorn. This is for making yes. regular Pokeballs. They have all the different color ones. Um, and the red ones are what are used to make normal Pokeballs, and I think a bunch of different yes. other ones. I think the red ones are required for like yes. a lot of them. So I'm going to put this back on fast forward while I go and collect a bunch more Apricorns. Yes, another red one. Yes, more red ones. Want one more red one. I see our last one. <sighs> Let's go get it. Yes. Come here. Yeah. All right. Now I'm going to fast forward while I run back to the home and mine some stone on the way there. thing I wanted to show you is you can take these apricorns and you can plant them in the ground. I'm going to have myself a little apricorn farm, a pokeball farm if you will. Alright, so let's take these guys back in. Boom, boom, boom. What? Does have to be in the middle? Uh, what? Why is this not working? Oh! Oops. Apparently, I need to cook them. I did not know that. I'm going to see if the wooden button works. Otherwise, I've got a bunch of stone. While those cook, I'm going to make myself some more tools, some more appropriate tools, so I'm not trying to cut down a tree with a pickaxe. I'm surprised that worked. Did it backwards than the way I normally do it. And then I can also do shovel. If I were playing vanilla, I would probably make a sword too, but I don't really need a sword for Pokemon. I don't feel like going out and stabbing a Mareep or anything. Though the swine ups are super annoying when you're running past them. Let's go throw our some stuff our stuff in. Oh, we can pull these out and make out of these. So let's do that. Boop boop boop. There we go. Pokeball disc. And then we gotta do the same thing with those that we did with the iron disc and anvil. Boop. Do do do. There. Perfect. 
beat the crap out of it. Boom, boom, boom. What should we catch? It'll probably be like a Rattata or a Pidgey or something, because anything else is too high level. Or a, a Nidoran. I don't like Nidoran. I'm going to try to get Pidgey. I'm going to go try to find a Pidgey to get. If I were playing the handheld version of the game, I would definitely have a Pidgey. So let's see what happens if I try to do this with the wooden button. Does it work? It does not work, so it has to be a stone button. So let's do... What? Okay, so apparently I missed the fact that to make cobblestone into stone, you have to cook it. So let's do some of that. And while that's working, we'll go plant our other apricorns that we have. So, oh wow, holy cow. So that wasn't gone that long, and these guys are starting to go pretty good. Take my axe. I'm going to clear off a little space here and expand my garden, outdoor garden area that I have created. Alright, and now let's plant some of these apricorns. So let's put a row of yellow guys. Hmm. Do one more row. Alright, now I'm going to plant my black ones. Let's do blacks just there. And let's do blue guys here. And then let's do pink guys here. I'm not exactly sure what all the different kinds of apricorns do. I know they create different kinds of pokeballs, but I never did that in any of the games. Um, I really mostly played the first few Pokemon games, red, yellow, blue. And that was for the most part it. But I loved them. I it played the card game like crazy. Alright, so now got my actual buttons. Iron base, Pokeball lid, buttons. Five Pokeballs. We are Pokemon Masters. Alright, now let's go catch us a Pokemon. Oh, it's dark out. Carry my axe around because it's dark out and I'm scared. Even though there's nothing in here that will hurt me. Though there are Pokemon that will just attack me for no reason. Speaking of which, that happened to me recently, so I should heal Bulbasaur up before we go. What's up with this Pidgey? I'm not going to sit here and throw Pokeballs at it while it's flying. I already know that doesn't work. I hope I can find them out in the world not flying. I don't know if I've seen any that aren't flying. Yeah, Squirtle. Alright. So yeah, please come up with a name for Squirtle. Um, something appropriate. I'm trying to make this a somewhat clean channel. Um... And whatever Pokemon we catch here, whether it's Rattata or Pidgey or let's see. See what some of this stuff out here. All this stuff last time I was out here was way too high a level. Spearow. Let's stay away from that Arbuck. Arbucks are notorious for just attacking me and I don't like it. There's a level four Rattata. If that ain't perfect, I don't know what it is, unless this is a level five Rattata. Ha! <laughs> oh my god. Couldn't even have planned that better. Alright, so let's... Ugh. Oh no. Yeah. Come on, Squirtle. Oh, my aim is so bad with these Pokeballs. Stop moving! There we go. Tackle. 
Quick attack, of course. Let's tackle again and then use the Pokeball. Uh, uh, Alright, so it's not quite in the red where I'd like it to be, but it's fine. Pokeballs. Pokeball. Huh. Come on, Rattata. Rattata. Come on. Come on, I wish I had buttons to tap, like in, like, so I can make it a better chance to catch. Come on. Waiting. Yeah! Captured Rattata. Now we have a level 5 Rattata. I'll try to fight this Pidgey, even though it's probably not going to work. It actually looks like a huge Pidgey. Maybe it's just because I'm standing so close to it. But I'm going to accidentally hit something else with these Pokeballs one of these times. Like, I, can't, I feel like it would be stupid if they made it so you can't even catch, like, can't even fight Pidgeys. Oh, God! Back off, Arbok. Back off. I want nothing to do with you. I'm an axe. See what I did to that bush? It's your face. Oh, God, run. Alright. So let's go heal our Rattata. So yeah, I think I'm going to end the episode there. Dun 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 dun. Yeah. Throw our stones and stuff in here. But yeah, um, feel free to subscribe, like this video, throw comments down below, tell me how bad I'm doing, how much I suck at this game. I'm hoping next time. What can we do next time? We'll try to make different kinds of Pokeballs and uh, try to level up our Squirtle a little bit. Maybe expand our our Pokemon world. Yeah, you know, we still need to make a Pokedex. So much to do, so much to do. Let me know below if there's anything you want me to do in the next episode. Anyways, I am Golgothin, and this has been Minecraft Pixelmon Mod. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time. Cue the music.